everyone! So this weekend I went to Vancouver. I was able to travel with New Leaf Airlines. It's a new Canadian airline company that offers really low airfares to a few different cities in Canada, such as Abbotsford, Edmonton, Halifax, Winnipeg, Kelowna if you like wine tasting, um, Hamilton if you want to go to Toronto or if you want to go to Hamilton. I actually booked my ticket to go to Abbotsford, which is about a 45 minute drive um, to Vancouver. You can take a one-way flight for about $49 and that's on the low end. It can range between $49 to $199 and the difference in that is how early in advance you book it. So it was an older plane, it was a Boeing 737. On my flight, the seats were about 70% filled. That means you might have an empty seat next to you, which is always good. Who doesn't want some more arm space? They don't give you snacks. So if you're used to getting that snack and that drink on the plane, definitely don't have those expectations for this flight. They do give you water, so that's the one and only thing that they will give you for free. If you get motion sickness, this might not be the plane for you because they don't have those um, pupates on the back of the seats that I normally see. They don't have in-flight entertainment, uh, no Wi-Fi, and they don't have any movies or TV shows. But what you can do is bring in an iPad or if you download something to your phone, you can watch that. But really, for a short flight to Vancouver, probably don't need it, just sleep or nap or something like that. The only downside for me was that when we got into Abbotsford, we had to rent a car. But once you got off the plane, the airport's really small. When you get off, you'll see the conveyor belts for your luggage so you can grab it right away. I would definitely recommend if there's two of you to have one person waiting in line to get the car and the other person to grab the luggage. Because if you're grabbing the luggage first and then getting the rental car, everybody else is doing that. And you're going to be waiting like an extra 45 minutes. Renting a car was about $100, $150. And you got to drive your own car into the city instead of taking a taxi. So the thing to know with New Leaf is the price might be low, but there are a lot of additional fees that you have to take into consideration. For boarding passes, I would definitely recommend filling it out online and getting it emailed to you because if you were to show up at the counter, they would charge you an additional $10 to print off your boarding pass. You have to learn to travel light. You can bring in a purse, you know, something about 20 pounds and under, but definitely not a carry-on. They will charge you for a carry-on. If you get their checked-in luggage, it's going to cost you about $25 to $30 and pay for any luggages online. Don't do it at the airport, they're going to charge you at least another $5 to $10 more. Overall, I really did enjoy the flight. I mean, what, what can you really expect? It was an hour and a half flight, a really cheap airfare, $50 per person per one way. Yeah, I mean, their service wasn't like spectacular, but hey. The price was good. Would I go on it again? Yeah. Yeah, I would. I mean, with airfares nowadays, I think the cheapest I've seen my Goofy for a long time is about $300. So to go for one third of that price, that's a no-brainer. <laughs> the cheap side of me talking, I'm definitely going to go back. <laughs> So I hope you enjoyed uh, my review on Newly and if you guys had experiences let me know. Thank you so much for watching.